Hi guys, my name is Sharon and I really want to start my YouTube channel just to like talk about things I like really. Uh, I, I just like like sharing and I like learning um, about new things like a lot. So um, I just want to give some background. I'm from LA. I'm Latina, first gen. Um, I was in SF before, but just like a year ago, I moved to Switzerland to be with my partner who's doing their PhD, um, here in lightning physics. And I'm supposed to be starting my PhD in the fall at the University of Oxford in material science. Fingers crossed it actually happens, but like with like scholarships and everything, I'm, it's, I mean, let's hope for the best but it's not looking good at the time but I'm also applying to other PhD programs that are like actually like state that they're funded um so we'll see stay tuned but um my interests I love hiking which is like a big bonus of living in Switzerland because like that's pretty much all they do like hiking and skiing like I snowboard too um I'm no expert but I can hold my own thankfully um, I love reading, like, anything, like, I'm, like, a black hole of reading, like, you give me a book and I will consume it entirely, um, I love manga, like, manga, Korean manga, like, manhwa, um, like, Japanese, Korean, like, anything, I love it all, I love, like, my pr obsession right now, I would say, is, like, historical isekai, like, um, I, I just, there's just something about, like, reading a manga where, like, the main lead, she's, like, tr treated unfairly and she goes back in time and gets justice and it's all kick-ass, so I love that. Um, I also love yoga and, yeah, I just, I think, like, today I'm gonna start with just talking about, like, I really don't know. I guess I could talk about something that I don't know if people know about, which is, like, so, um, living in SF, like, the attire is yoga pants, um, like, and obviously, like, wearing the best, so, you know, lemon specifically, but, like, when I moved there, I had, I had an obsession already, <laughs> um but I'm just like oh wow these are like really fancy I should step up my game but what I really like is like a lot of companies when they're starting out they like give you a free pair of like yoga pants and all you have to do is usually play shipping and then like later on you know it ends up being worthwhile because like for example I got a pair of like girlfriend collective um pop flex um, yoga pants and I think I spent like 15 bucks on them and now they go for like 40 or more um so I really like that and since I was so obsessed I was just like why not but the problem was that like when you move to Europe like you only wear yoga pants when you exercise you can't just like go out to grocery shopping and be like it's comfortable so I've been learning to wear jeans more often but I had to essentially like get rid of so many yoga pants and I just want to talk about my favorites I'm going to start first with my naughty fate like <laughs> there so it's the Nike pro ones but like um the ankle ones and the thing is I'm short wow a Latina who's short crazy um and I will say that not all brands go to that like Nike I specifically have to buy the ankle ones and they usually fit like at my um like perfectly but um like don't get me wrong I like I like wearing these but they're not like they don't have pockets like they're really thin um my favorite pair of yoga pants is actually the girlfriend collective ones and they actually don't even have the name on it because like probably they had just started but they are like the most buttery soft yoga pants i've ever had but they are long so i do have to cuff them if you want like yoga pants that like fit you just right old navy and gap are like athleta sorry are my go-to so my favorite ones are my like the athleta ones which 
I feel like was a splurge, but usually when like they have sales, like I'm just like, hell yeah, like 50% off, like here I come. So these are my um, fab ones. And the thing is that they are perfectly fit. Like I love not having a cuff them. These are like my first Athleta ones and they have like the little like most impractical thing because like when it's cold you're feeling it but they're so cute um my sec my ultimate favorite ones are these ones also i thought okay i think i these are the athletic ones i love the color i used to have like so many colors um the i did end up buying the fancy ones i got the pair of aloe ones um because I'm just like, everyone in SF wears them. I have to have a pair. But to be honest, they get matte. Like, I don't know how to describe this. Do you see that? Like, I don't like this. I don't like having to shave my clothes. Like, I'm already supposed to be shaving, like, my coats. I can't, like, shave yoga pants on top of that. Um, and that was just, like, something where I was like, I spent a lot of money on this and the fact that they got matty like mm, it's not it's not the move um airy is my ultimate favorite like i love old navy because it's affordable but in terms of affordability and quality i think airy um really like is the best thing i can do i have like every time airy had a sale i love it and they do like cater to short to like um petite sizes yeah i got the chill play move like the um the the i don't even know what that's called like the bell bottomy one and they're super comfortable and i also do have a pair of lululemons i don't know where they are but they're also too long for me and i heard like you can go to lululemon and get them um tailored for you which is really cool but i'm just like or you could just be more like size ex like exclusive to me at least that just makes sense like especially because like so many brands are doing it you know like you there's so many like brands that are having sizes like for taller inseam shorter inseam like um extra like extra sizing um it just feels like a customer like when a customer is faced with all these options just like go for the one that the company that actually like caters to you and you'll have to go to the store to get it like paid for but yeah anyway i would say my ultimate like in terms of affordability and comfort airy is my favorite and i like one of my favorite things about like shopping on airy is and this is like not sponsored at all. This is just me talking about my obsession, which is yoga pants. Um, I love being able to go on the app and seeing like all types of models, like literally everything. Like it's refreshing, you know, because I'm just like, I do not look like a Victoria's Secret model. Um, and to be able to see other models um, wearing that like look that really represent like humanity you know because we're all so different it's really nice like i don't know it just feels really good it feels comforting you know especially like for swimsuits oh my god i love airy for swimsuits and one of the things about like online shopping is swimsuits because you're just like wow she looks super cute and then you get the swimsuit and you're just like i don't look like her i forgot about that while i was shopping oops um but then you go on like airy swimsuits and you're just like that model looks like me it's gonna look great and you get it and you're just like i look exactly like that yay um i love that for yoga pants because um like especially when they put the height like when i'm shopping i always look at what like it doesn't matter what store i'm shopping at i always like to look at the model's height um and size you know and I don't think they put weight that would be bizarre but yeah usually height and what size they're wearing because it really helps you know because sometimes you'll be like it's a small and you look at the model and she's wearing a medium and you're just like you are taller than me but you're thinner than me so i should get a medium as well even though i usually wear small um sometimes the small is too big like sometimes brands can be 
like run on the larger side and that's why i also like reviews but like part of the reviews is that not everyone's gonna review it like i should be reviewing more and yet i forget you know what i mean um so like that's something i like to do is if there's no reviews look at the model look at her size look at her height and just be like how do i compare to this i guess it's just like the scientist in me who does that but yeah so i like old navy i don't seem to have i think i like let go of my old navy ones but they're affordable like if you aren't someone who's just like i can't afford like to splurge on um going to athleta um or even airy like when i used to like when i was growing up airy was like more affordable i feel like it did go up in price like to be fair but old navy has stayed pretty consistent on their pricing and if like especially because sometimes you can get like a ten dollar pair of yoga pants at old navy and they're really good quality um it's worth it you know um so yeah that's one of my many interests that I'll be talking about but I figured I should start by talking about something I'm super passionate about and that's shopping specifically for yoga pants like you guys don't understand like this stack right here this is not even half of what I had before I left California like I had to cut my yoga pants like the amount I had twice because in SF, like I said, I was hiking a lot, especially like during the Ronas, like I was hiking a lot with my friends, so I'm just like, I need more yoga pants, not true, you don't need that many yoga pants, but whatever, we'll talk about my addiction another time, um, but more importantly, I'm just like, I want to be comfortable, and SF like allows you to be comfortable without judging you, um, in a bizarre way, like there's definitely judgment, but you know, whatever, um, but I was just like, I have to be realistic. I think I have like 30 pairs of yoga pants and I don't think that's a realistic thing for everyone. So then I like, I donated, I keep them all as much like as I can in good quality. So I donated the real, like some of them and I think a lot of them were the old navy ones. Um, but I do still have like a lot of the old navy tops that I really like because they were like really breathable for working out. Um and i yeah so i can share those next time um but i think that's all i have to say so yeah i went from 30 to i don't know what i have 10 so the first time i had 30 then i had to cut it and i had like 15 and now i'm at 10 and i don't even wear all of them like these ones like they're <laughs> again it like one of the things when you buy it early on is they don't even have the brand they're like one of those like early booty edition yoga pants like when they had just started bringing it out and i'm just like 10 bucks shipping and they're cute like um i love the color i think it goes really well with my skin i have not worn them at all because one i have to pull them up like a lot um if you want to use it <laughs> for what it's meant to be used to help you look bodacious and that's a lot of pulling up it can get really uncomfortable really fast because i don't have a super long torso so you know i'm i feel like i'm like well old, like those like cartoon versions of like older people with their pants like all the way up to here when reality like yeah they're not that far off from certain areas and yeah it's not uncomfortable like comfortable sorry and props to those who can wear it and who look damn good wearing it. I will keep them because my addiction prevents me from losing them. But I will not buy any more yoga pants. And you can hold that <laughs> for to me. I am, as of today, the 10th of February 2023. I promise not to buy any more yoga pants. And if I do slap me forthwith like bring out the white glove challenge me to a duel because it's the least i deserve um but yeah i will be posting more about random stuff i think my next video i want to do it about manga um and then i have like a really interesting story about how my friend went to the nobel prize award and how but yeah 
I don't want to talk about it yet because I need to think about how I'm going to talk about it. Like, it's really, really cool, but it just made me think about a lot of stuff. But yeah, stay tuned. <laughs>